Okay, guys, so I have uh, something to share with you. Uh, good morning, good afternoon, and good evening to you all, uh, depending on your location at this time of the day. Let me also use this opportunity and wish you guys a happy Sunday. It's a beautiful Sunday afternoon. All right, um, without wasting much of your time, uh, Dr. Yusuf Dati Ahmed, of course, we know that um, he was the running mate or he's the running mate to Peter Ubi. We all remember what happened after the 25 February election. But guess what happened? Both the PDP and Labour Party filed an appeal against Tinibu. Okay. Uh, not only the process, but also what actually led to INEC to declare uh, Tinibu the winner, the irregularities, winner of that election. So the question is, could this be as in hopeful for both the Labour Party and the Peter B supporters, just like um, what Dr. Yusuf Dati Baba Ahmed says. Imagine this, this is the case of a party who took third and not the party who took um, who took third. That's, uh, that shows, um, that show tells something, okay? So uh, let me know what you guys think. I quickly want to update you that um, Labour Party supporters, Peter B supporters, uh, they are still optimistic. Uh, they still believe that the court will do the right thing. Remember, um, it happened in Kenya. It also happened in Malawi. But in Nigeria, people have this, um, you know, ideology, speculation that, yeah, whatever happened, uh, uh, the government owned the court. Whatever they tell the judiciary to do, that is what they will do. That it cannot happen in Nigeria. But this time around, let us wait and see what the judiciary will do because in Kenya they don't get two heads. In Malawi when it happened, they didn't have two heads. But this time around, all eyes is on Nigerian judiciary. So I believe that the court uh, will do the right thing uh, this uh, time around. But however, uh, let me know your position. Do you think um, the government owned the court that uh, they can influence the court because uh, I remember somebody talking about the same issue and the lady was like, uh, if they bring bullion van money in bullion van to um, the judiciary, that they can do the undo. But let us watch. Everybody is looking at the Nigerian judiciary this time around. So um, let's wait and see. Keep our fingers crossed to see what they are able to do. And then the Labour Party, they have a lot of evidence uh, against the irregularities in that election. So I believe uh, the court uh, will do uh, the right thing this time around. So I quickly want to update you uh, the hopefulness of uh, Dr. Ahmed Baba Dati, uh, that um, it shows something, the court to dismiss uh, the case of the petition of PDP and not the petition of Labour Party. See you in another update.